Greetings everyone, and welcome to a new ASMR gaming news Fortnite daily item shop video. So this is the first item shop update of Chapter 2, Season 2. So let's see what's on the item shop for the start of the season. Uh, wow, we- okay, they're giving us a lot of new stuff already on like the first update, okay. That's awesome. Weight Breaker Pack is still there, so if you're picking anything up, be sure to use code ASMR Gaming. So, there's a new Terra skin. Enough planning. We enough enough planning. It's time for action. Oh, there's two. Okay, there's. Wait, how many edit styles are there? Okay, whoa. <laughs> well, for 1,200 feet bucks, there's a bunch of edit styles for this. So, enough planning. It's time for action. Part of the Artificial Evolved set. Uh, huh. Let's see. I like the glow. That, that Wow, that looks nice. Look at the glow. Okay, so these are okay, but I really like the glowing aspect of it. Wait, glow on. Yeah, look at that. Look at the arms and stuff. Oh, even the visor thing. There's like bullets that are glowing as well. She's wearing around like her waist is a belt. Yellow one. That's actually pretty cool. I like that. Terra. She comes with the Puma pack. A hey, Pumas. Oh, look the uh, Oh, okay. That's an awesome back bling. That's awesome. The, the eyes actually glow and stuff. That is cool. That is cool. Oh, now I kind of want this just for the back bling. That's awesome. Uh, Growl and Glow Puma Pack. Let's see what else is in this set. Chargers move in part of the Artificial Evolved set. Okay, let's see animation. Nothing special for animation. Sound is okay. I like the design though. Very nice, kind of like swords. I don't know why they're called chargers, maybe. Huh. I like the second edit style a little bit more, the Alter Ego one. I like that green color, like aqua marine green. Looks nice, looks nice. Okay, so that's everything in the Artificial Evolved set for Terra. Let's take a look, I guess, what's on the other version. I, I am really impressed that there's so many edit styles for a skin that's only 1,200 V-Bucks. Here is the tech skin. Wow, that hair. That hair, though. <laughs> Interesting. Oh, wow. The glow, he is it. Wait, does it does, does his eyes glow? I didn't notice that about her. Wait, let me let me see. I was I was not paying attention. Let me see. Do her eyes glow with the glowing edit style? Cause it seems like his do. Uh, the eyes don't seem to glow, but his kind of do for some reason. Wait a second. When the glow version comes, now nah, they're just bright green. Okay, for a second I thought they glowed. Armed and dangerous part of the artificial evolved set tech. So interesting name tech. I wonder if he's like into tech stuff. <laughs> uh, I think the female skin's a little bit better, but I do like this camo. Not not in the, where's the camo? Yeah, the camo pants on this. That actually looks pretty good. It's like a vest on this one. The glowing version is definitely the best. I like the glow. So he has like a robotic cybernetic arm or something. Armed and dangerous. Hey, the name of the Juice World song. R.I.P. R.I.P. the Juice. Uh, technical glow. Packed with plans. Alter ego. I really like the glow. He has the better back. No, you know what? Mm, I think the female has the better back bling. What's her name? Uh... She has the better back bling with the Puma pack. Yeah, Terra definitely has a better back bling than him. He just has like a regular backpack packed with plans, but eh, nothing too special. It's okay. Does it have another? Yeah, the back bling also has different edit styles. <laughs> Let me know what you think of this skin. Do you like it? Do you prefer the female version? I like the glow on this one though, like on the arms. His hair is kind of weird though, not gonna lie. His hair looks like he's like 60 years old, but then like the rest of his face looks like, hey, he's only like 30 or something. <laughs> That's funny. Here are the serrated slicers for the other kind of hacking part.
part of the artificial evolved set. No unique animation, uh, sound is okay, design is nice, definitely goes with this artificial evolve set. And I like the second edit style the most, the alter ego edit style is really nice, is really really nice. Now I have to think, do I get this skin, because I do kind of like it, especially this edit style right here, I like the glowing arm. Hers is nice too though, she has like a elbow guard thing, I mean a shoulder guard thing. Like, if I'm gonna get it, I'll probably use this edit style the most. It is nice. I don't really know if I like that eye thing, though. That eye scanner thing. Oh, it's like a scouter from Dragon Ball Z. Vegeta, what does the scouter say? It's over 9,000. 9,000. <laughs> no, for real, it looks like a scouter from uh, Dragon Ball Z. That's funny. <laughs> uh, good set, though. That's a pretty good new set. Dark Rex is back, okay. The Dark King of the Dino Guard set. Part of the Dino Guard set. <laughs> uh, Dino Guard skin here. Um, I like the purple edit style the most. This one is okay. His eyes always creep me out in this dark version, this dark series. Looks a little bit evil, but I do like how this purple version looks. I don't know, you let me know what you think in the comments. I, I always like this one. 1,200 V-Bucks, the Dark King of the Dino Guard, comes with the dark scaly back bling. This is also a little bit animated, the tail will move a little dark around the edges. There are two edit styles, purple and default. Uh, purple one is my favorite, I think, as well for the back bling, so both the skin and back bling, I think, look best in purple. But yeah, part of the dark series, it's been a while, nice to see this back. Dark Dino Bones Pound with Primal Power, 800 V-Bucks. I like the tips, they're like <laughs> pink. I, I don't know if that's like supposed to be poison, like poison tipped or something, but looks kind of creepy. You can see the bone marrow inside the bones there, like pink liquid. <laughs> kind of creepy, kind of weird, but also kind of cool. 800 V-Bucks, no unique animation. Sound is nice, the design is crazy. I like the design a lot of these for these. Dark Triceraops is back as well. Uh, I see this one, especially this edit style, a lot in games. Sink your teeth into darkness. This is actually kind of a tryhard skin right here. Dark Triceraops skin uh, with the purple edit style. At least I've seen <laughs> people using that a lot, and they're pretty good players. Not dynamo level, but still fairly good. Dark Hatchling back bling, a mystery from prehistory. Prehistory. <laughs> uh, I like the purple. Edit style for this. I, I don't know. The purple edit style just looks nice. Sink your teeth into darkness. And then we're back to Dark Rex. So that's back today. Uh, there's a new wrap. Yellow Glow. Show your style. 300 V-Bucks. Part of the Artificial Evolve set. Uh, I don't really see it glowing. It looks just like a yellow wrap. Maybe it glows in game. Uh, oh. So happy the SMG's back in the game, by the way. Suppressed SMG for life. For life. But mm, it glows a little bit. I'm, no, I'm noticing now, but I don't really like this wrap as much. It's okay. It's pretty basic. Not animated at all. I can see why it's 300 V-Bucks, but hey, it goes with the set. Dream Feet is back. Get some boogie in your boots. Introduced in Season 8. Uh, Dream Feet's fun. I like the music for this one. The emote's kind of wacky, like the dance, <laughs> but the music is fun. So if you like the music, I recommend it. For 500 V-Bucks, it's pretty good. Revel is back. One of the better 200 V-Bucks emotes for sure. This one and a few others are definitely worth getting for the price. Nothing wrong with a little celebration. So yeah, you get an elimination, you win the match. This is a great emote to use for those occasions. Nothing wrong with a little celebration. The music is really catchy, too. It just stays in your head. Nice tune. Nice tune. Uh, not much movement going on for the dance. You just, like, snap your fingers. Move from side to side, but, you know, nice, nice. Drum major. Lead the line and step in time. It's a traversal emote, so you can actually walk across the map doing this. Uh, not a big fan of the music on this one. Uh, emote is kind of crazy, though. I mean, look at that. <laughs> uh... 
that takes a lot to walk like that for a very long period of time. You can actually walk across the entire Fortnite map doing this. If you have the time, you can try it out in playgrounds uh, for 500 V-Bucks. It's okay. If you like the music, I'd say get it. Recon Ranger is back. 800 V-Bucks. I have the skin. One thing I always thought was kind of cool about this was the pink. She has like a pink uh, bulletproof vest thing going on here. Uh, also like some pink laces on her boots. So even though there's a lot of like gray camo on this, the pink kind of gives it a special style. So for an uncommon skin, it's pretty good. Uh, she also has tattoos on her arms, which kind of look awesome. Expert Field Intel Ranger, Recon Ranger. 800 V-Bucks for that. And lastly, Creepy Clown Skin Peekaboo is back. I see you. Uh, there's the creepy version. Okay, not that creepy. And then there's the creepier version, which is uh, very creepy. Uh, imagine waking up at night and seeing something like that in the corner of your room. I would probably scream and run away for sure. <laughs> Battle Balloon, where we pop in. I like that top is kind of animated. The balloon will move around as you're running. And it's a recreation of the battle bus in balloon balloon form. Uh, no edit style for the balloon, by the way, uh, for the back bling here, but battle balloon. But if you like clown skins, this one is back. So yeah, that is everything on the item shop today. I'm really surprised that we got two new skins, two new harvesting tools. So that's pretty awesome. Let me know which one I should pick up because I'm kind of tempted to go for the girl version just because I like the the glow edit style on her but I don't really like that eye scouter thing and I think his camo edit style is a little bit better so <laughs> I don't know which one to get let me know in the comments uh, I'll try to pick one up but yeah thanks for watching and I will see you all next time so so long and farewell <laughs>